friends, welcome to Cosplay Kitchen. Today we are celebrating the Lion King by recreating the 1994 Lion King Celebration Parade costume. We're going to be making a healthy meal prep for you today using a traditional African recipe called Bow Booty. It's protein packed, low calorie, and super easy to make a huge batch. So hop on in, join the party, and let's get started. with a hot cast iron skillet. In that, we're gonna have olive oil, half of an onion, and ground bison. Now traditionally, this recipe would be utilizing lamb. We're utilizing bison, however, it's still gonna give you that gamey taste. However, it's really, really low in fat and calories, while still having a lot of the same health benefits as beef. Once that starts to get just a little brown, then we're gonna go ahead and add in our cinnamon, and our curry. We're gonna get that all nice and mixed together until it's almost fully cooked. Then we're gonna go and deglaze the pan. If you're not familiar with what that means, that's when you have a very hot pan and you add in the liquid and all of those wonderful brown bits on the bottom are then lifted up and brought into the recipe. So we're gonna deglaze it with some rice wine vinegar. We're gonna go ahead and turn our heat off. And then to that, we're gonna add sliced, uncooked almonds, adding a little bit of texture, a little bit more protein. Now here's the next thing that's really gonna take your bow booty from being uh, to being really fantastic. You wanna utilize some really great raisins. If you go and you take your raisins out of the box and they look a little bit more like a rock than a, than a grape, probably not the right one. I go to my local farmer's market on Tuesdays and get these grapes that they make themselves. They're wonderful and jammy on the inside, kind of almost like biting into one of those thumbprint cookies that you used to eat as a kid. So we're gonna go ahead and add those in. Once that's all mixed up, we're gonna go ahead and start making our egg mixture. All right, let's go ahead and get our egg mixture put together. Today we're gonna be utilizing four eggs. You never want to go and mix eggs until you're absolutely ready for them. If you mix eggs too early, it causes them to denature and the texture won't be nearly as nice. To that, we're going to be adding in our breadcrumbs, some non-fat or low-fat milk. Now, to what I understand, the booty is usually done with a higher milk fat content. But since we're going for a healthier version, I found that low fat or non fat milk works just as well in this particular recipe. Speaking of healthier options, today we're going to be using agave syrup. Now agave syrup tastes sweeter to the tongue than sugar. So this allows you to use half of the agave syrup than you would as sugar. Now it doesn't work for all recipes, so be careful what you're swapping it out for. We're gonna go ahead Get that all mixed together. Now we're not looking to incorporate any air today. We're just looking to go ahead and get it very well mixed. Here we go. Just like that. Now we're gonna go ahead and go back to the stove and we're going to grab on to our meat mixture because that's a fun for us to say. Now we're gonna go ahead and get it dumped back into our egg mixture. We're gonna go ahead and get this all mixed up together. Now once it's mixed up, we're gonna put it in either a nine by nine or an eight by eight pan in a 325 degree oven for approximately 40 to 55 minutes. How to know it's done? Pierce it with a sharp knife. If it comes out clean, it's ready to go. Now if you have a big family, you're a big eater, have friends coming over, or just want a really great meal prep, you can double this recipe, put it in a nine by 13 pan. It will reheat beautifully out of the refrigerator. However, we've learned the hard way in this house that it does not freeze well. Out of the refrigerator, perfect though. It'll last you up to roughly about four to five days and it'll still be perfectly fresh. Let's go ahead and get this in the oven. So thank you so much for joining us today. I hope you had a good time. If you did, be sure to throw up a like, maybe even consider subscribing. Join us on Mondays for a new cocktail, cosplay, or recipe. And in the meantime, don't eat yellow snow.